Welcome back guys and here is us landing in Antalya. The flight was very very smooth and here is us walking in the airport. So we just arrived to Antalya and we were looking for a sim but it's actually really really expensive it's like 699 Turkish lira for 35 gigabyte I don't know if that's normal but for me that's quite expensive we have to wait another 40 minutes for our um, coach to arrive at our hotel So they've got a Burger King here and a Starbucks, Vodafone for your sim. And that's the only things I find quite familiar. Okay, so it's 11 o'clock here. We landed at 10 o'clock. And yeah, it's actually really, really warm here. I was expecting it. I still have my jacket on. Our shuttle car arrived. We're going to have a 15 minutes break at this gas pump. It has someone selling ice cream and making fresh orange juice. I'm not sure but I feel like the driver definitely gets a commission because it was like they were expecting us. And they mostly take euros here but you can pay by any currency, Turkish lira too. So we tried the Turkish wrap here and it was quite nice, very tasty. Guys, 2 hours and 25 minutes from getting onto the shuttle, we are finally dropping our first passengers with us. The next family were only around 5 minutes away from the first and most of the hotels are at walking distance from each other. This is us finally entering our hotel which is Kemal Bay in Alania.
We received our all-inclusive band. We are going towards our rooms here and we booked three bedrooms. Um, one for my sister, and one for me and my husband and one for my parents. Hey guys, so we finally reached our hotel and let me tell you it was not the easiest ride ever. It took more than two hours to get here. From Antalya airport to Alanya it took over two hours and yeah, we finally reached here. All I can say that I need to sleep. Look at our room guys. So this is a double bed and a single bed and we actually got three rooms and two of the rooms are like this. And my sister's gonna have her own room. But I feel like we could have just hired um two rooms, like we could have just booked two rooms and it would have been enough. So yeah. <clears throat> yeah, so our hotel room is quite nice. It has a TV, some chairs. A fridge that has water, a kettle, some sugar, milk, which is free too. Um, they gave us like some cards, so your towel card and your massage card. We left our luggages. We yeah. have a dressing table, and then I think this is our cupboard. It's quite spacious. I just don't have the energy to unbag everything at the moment. One thing I've noticed guys is that they haven't provided any bathrobes. So I'm just looking at my bathroom and everything and they don't have any bathrobes here. Yeah, so I'm just gonna wash my face, get into my pajamas and that's it, get to bed. I don't even know if I'll be able to wake up for breakfast. Apparently breakfast starts from seven to 10. Okay, so I'm just going to take my pyjamas out and I'm going to do an unbagging video tomorrow. My sister and my husband just came back seeing my parents' room downstairs, which was supposed to be my sister's, but my parents don't want her to stay in her room by herself on a different floor, which is downstairs. So they swapped with her and apparently they got the best view, best beach view and they have the nice swimming pool view too. I can see us. Okay, so there was no bathrobes. They didn't provide any sort of like complimentary shampoos or toothpaste or anything like that or soaps. Um, there's no slippers as well. There's no bathtub. So that's a few things I've noticed. Okay, there was no bin provided, so I had to move the bathroom one in here. Okay, so three things or few things that I noticed whilst being a newcomer at Antalya is that first of all the whole road the journey seemed like i was in on a dual carriageway yeah second of all people here love smoking third of all um the area near the airport is really expensive like trying to get a sim card was so expensive um we had a 15 minute break as you saw the stuff inside was quite expensive compared to other areas probably we didn't see any shops the whole journey felt like there was just gas pumps everywhere um after around two hours we came to alania and that's when we start seeing the hotels which were very beautiful they all look like luxury hotels um we got to our hotel which is kemal bay in alania and it is so pretty like the whole area is massive and the hotel but i would like to explore it tomorrow hopefully because at this point, I just need to get fresh and get to bed. I was going to unpack my bag, so I'm not sure. I'll just leave that for the second part. So please do subscribe and keep on watching. I will be uploading a vlog every single day. Thank you. Love you guys.